Hi, I'm Kashyana Singh from Chicago calling in for Wednesday Night Poetry by Kai Kogan. Thank you, Kai, for everything you do each week. I'm going to read two poems today. The first one is called Ode to Paws Cities, and this just came up on the Fox Poetry Box, which is poetry in boxes. Um, and this is run uh, by a beautiful woman in St. Charles, Illinois. Ode to Paws Cities. A paused spring in convalescence, a pandemic sings of equivalence, a people paused as battles rage, a critical loss of life in triage, a busy morgue of consequence, a distance locked yet defenseless. Ode to Pause Cities. The second one that I'm going to read today is again from my book, Shelling Peanuts and Stringing Words. And this poem is called Heartache. Heartache. What if we have two hearts, like we have to everything else? Would we then be more wanting, more receiving? Would we hurt less, yearn less, or at least less on each side? Repair better, love equally, balance the brain, outweigh it if needed, accumulate more, therefore give more and abundantly, stay young at heart, one being the sturdy support to the other during a bypass, stay tenacious because there would be more nerve, stay tenacious because there would be more nerve, be able to keep a heart, even if one was pounding out of your chest, stay true to your heart. Stay true to your heart because one would always keep the other honest. Surely love deeper and with less exhaustion, since it would be with all my hearts. Life patterns evolve over ages. This may very well be an encounter waiting to occur. However, one pattern will not change, will continue to conform, has not altered, will not alter, and that is the abandonment at the end. When everything halts, if there were to be these extra organs, when they cease to pound the salve through the being, when the fragility of existence shows up unrelenting, it will not matter that there were two. It will not matter that they were two, they will still be unarousable, they will still be bewildered, still be susceptible to the end, and what they leave behind will still experience annihilation. What they leave behind will still experience annihilation, still survive the pilgrimage. After departure, the journey will still be one of surrender. Every step will only move in millimeters, no different if indeed. It is a fascinating thought though. If indeed we have two hearts, will they carry the weight easier along the journey of loss? Heartache. Thank you.